Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we start by taking a quick look at mining activity. Uh, you might have heard uh, the mining fees or the gas fees for on the Ethereum network are just off the charts. And uh, as you can see, <clears throat> if we go to the dollar amount, uh, you can see daily just for two rigs, I'm bringing in about $23 weekly 167 and monthly 726 dollars this is just crazy i can't imagine what the guys who have like uh five or six or seven cards are bringing in right now yeah so um i don't know how that happened but the gas fees on the ethereum network skyrocketed and uh yeah those who are mining are uh, actually <clears throat> making a killing right now um, today is Monday, the 10th of May, 2021, and I have, uh, you know, two graphics cards, uh, 30, 70s, and uh, that's how much I'm getting on a monthly basis, according to um, either mine. All right, let's head quickly to our stocks. The first one is Hall of Fame Resort and Entertainment Company. They're down uh, mid session today to three dollars twenty seven cent or oh, three dollars twenty nine cents now. Um, that's a slight recovery, but you can see it's just been a brutal, brutal uh, five day period for this stock. It's just been heading down slowly. How low will it get? It's anyone's guess. Um, at this point, again, I still remain very bearish on this. I don't think it's a good idea to throw your money in Hall of Fame, Resort and Entertainment. The Atika symbol, H-O-F-V. Uh, if you want to play with this, maybe you could be shorting it. But to uh, go long on H-O-F-V, I think it's not a very good idea right now. The next stock we're looking at is Dolphin Entertainment Inc., and they're down 7.30%. That is crazy. If you're watching this, I really hope you're not invested in this stock. Because uh, we called it out last week. Uh, DLPN, is, it wasn't a very good buy. As you can see, for the last five days, they've just been going down and down and down. So <clears throat> be careful. Do your due diligence. And on the flip side, I also do not recommend shorting these stocks. They've been known to go a hundred plus percent in one session. So even though they're down 8% today, you could wake up tomorrow and find out they're up more than a hundred percent. So be careful if you're messing around with these uh, stocks in the NFT space. And lastly, <clears throat> we're going to look at eBank International Holdings with the ticker symbol E-B-O-N, e -bon. And for today's session, they're down an incredible 9.42% and uh, trading now at $3.12. That is mind boggling. Uh, and let's look at the five day. For the five five day chart, you see it's just had a steady and uh, constant decline. So if you are invested in this stock, you might want to rethink your strategy. And also uh, with this, uh, some of these Chinese stocks, I do not recommend shorting them because you could wake up the next day and find out this thing is, it has gone to the moon. All right, <clears throat> for uh, coins, let's look real quick. Dogecoin is trading at uh, 48 cents. It's down 9.88%. Uh, SafeMoon is up 8.92%. And uh, a quick look at the cap recap of the market. Bitcoin is now at fifty-six thousand uh, dollars, down one point zero seven percent. Ethereum is up five point seven one percent, trading at four thousand one hundred and thirty-two dollars. XRP is down one point four one percent. Stella is up fourteen point four four percent, and again Dogecoin, you can see. It says down 15% for the past consecutive 24 hours, trading at 46 cents. So that's a little recap of your <coughs> crypto space. Um, we'll be back later on with uh, updates. And uh, let's take a quick look at the SafeMoon 
Twitter feed, see how many people we have on there right now. They're just uh, above 600,000 followers on Twitter. And the price of Save Moon reflects this, at least for today, uh, it's been going up. And if you look on the right, I think they had, that looks like Times Square. Uh, so yeah, they had a, they pulled an ad on the, the on Times Square. Anyways, that's what I had to share with you guys uh, this early afternoon. We will be talking about uh, the stocks later on at the close of today's session. Thanks for watching. See you.